Hi, Mary here from Germinal. I'm going to talk to you about the Pasture Profit Index, which is a new selection, selection tool which Chagas brought out back in 2014 in order to ident identify the varieties which are more suit most suited to your farming system. So the Pasture Profit Index, or P PPI as you may have heard it referred to, it's simply like the EBI for bulk selection. So what it does, it ranks varieties economically based on their key traits. So these key traits are spring, summer and autumn dry matter yield, quality, silage and persistency. Each trait gets an economic value. This economic value is then applied to the biological performance of each variety. Each variety then ends up with its total pasture profit index, which is the sum of each of these tra traits combined. So when you're looking at the pasture profit index, it's also important to pay attention to ploidy, which indicates whether it's a diploid or tetraploid. And generally speaking, you want about 40% tetraploid, 60% diploid in your mixtures. It's also important to pay attention to heading date. You want a narrow range in heading date when selecting, selecting varieties within a, within a mixture. Ideally, about seven days for silage mixtures and no more than 10 days for grazing mixtures. Depending on whether you're receding a grazing or silage field, then again, you're going to need to use the pasture profit index to evaluate varieties within this. So for example, for a grazing mixture, you want to focus on those traits which are most important from a grazing perspective. So this is seasonal dry matter production, spring and autumn being particularly particularly important, but also summer dry matter yield being of importance. Quality is hugely important, as is persistency. So it's useful to, to look at the pasture profit index. It comes out each spring um, and to evaluate how varieties are performing across each of the key traits and to evaluate your mixtures based on this. For further information on this topic and other topics, please go to g-source.org. Thank you.